this is exercise 3335A using the blend tool to create a three-dimensional surface and exercise 3336A patching a surface hole. I'm in the blend patch offset drawing file in the steps lesson 33 folder. I have converted the meshes that were in the drawing to surfaces using the convert to surface command. My UCS has been set equal to the WCS. All right, we'll begin with the surf blend command. We can enter the command on the keyboard, surf blend, or we can pick the button on the tool palette. AutoCAD asks us to select the first surface edge to blend. We'll start here. Okay, now it wants the second surface edge to blend. And there you have it. Hit enter and we have blended two surfaces. Okay, we're going to do this again using the third object and convert them. Now if you select one of these conversions you'll notice that you have a selection type arrow and you can change the type of surface that you've created. Okay, I'm going to clear that and I'm going to move on to the next exercise. This time we're going to use the surf patch command. We have a we've left ourselves a hole in our surface so we're going to use the surf patch command to repair that hole. You can enter the command surf patch on the keyboard or you can pick the button on the tool palette. AutoCAD wants you to select the surface edges to patch or chain. In this case we're going to use that chain option and then we can select one of the edges and you'll see that it makes its own chain. Hit enter, accept the rest of the defaults and it creates the patch. It looks a little funky but if you will look at your visual styles you can change the visual style and it looks just fine. Okay maybe not so great when it's yellow. <laughs> uh, let's try a realistic. That's a little bit better. Okay, save your drawing file and we will move on to something else.